Mom's oh, over. Mom. Mom. Mom, Aiden won't leave me alone. She totally started it. Guys, guys, quiet down. I'm on the phone. Mommy needs a break. Tracy's digital addiction to her smartphone has made her a distracted parent, and she's certainly not the only one. The Atlantic just came out with this article about the dangers of distracted parenting. The headline, when it comes to children's development, parents should worry less about their kids' screen time and more about their own. No, 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 no. you can't no. catch me. So you're out shopping at a nice boutique when you see kids out of control, their mother doing nothing to stop them. Do you speak up and reprimand them yourself, or do you stay quiet because they're not your kids? What would you do? <laughs> kids shouldn't even be allowed in the store. Our hidden cameras are rolling at Hangar Clothing Store. Mom! Mom! Guys, stop, I'm on the phone. It's my day off, guys. You gotta do your own thing. These two clearly see what's going on. We're just kids being kids. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Can I have your tag? I got you back. It's not bothering Time you guys, out. is it? No. Oh, okay. Good. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. They seem to have compassion for our stressed out mom. But will that change as kids being kids becomes kids being destructive? Kelly O'Doherty's compassion has now turned to concern as she searches for our mom. Oh, they're just playing. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. They're just playing. <laughs> but it adjusts from here. Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's okay. No worries. That's okay. Thank you. They're just being kids. <laughs> My mom's not paying attention. Oh, is that why you did that? Does she ignore you Yeah. Yeah. We asked her if she loved us, but she said, Shh, I'm on the phone having a vacation. After Kelly finishes paying, she still has her two cents yeah. left over for our mom. They don't think you love them. They ask if you love them. And that you say you're busy. That's why they do those Oh, those really? Things. Oh, it's my fault? Hi. I'm John Kenyon. Oh, wow. oh, <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! How are you? <laughs> I'm ready to cry. Hey, you were that upset. Huh? I tried to hug her when I was leaving because I felt so sorry for, for the little girl. And you told the mother. She was the one acting out. More than anything, I felt like they needed to be saved from her, not her being saved from them. Give it! Give it to me! Right away, this woman is shocked by what she's seeing. <laughs> Perfect! She turns to look for our she mom. Didn't even notice. Kids, you guys having fun? Yeah! Okay, good. It's good. better than the park. But says nothing as she walks by. You yeah. want to see it? No, no, sweetie, let me finish shopping. I would call my husband. That's not a good Where do you think? See, you guys can't be doing this. All right, I feel like this is a scary movie. Have you guys seen those scary movies? It's not a scary movie, it's television. What would you do? I <laughs> Bro, I do <laughs> <knew> it. <laughs> the look on your face was priceless, really. You were stunned. <laughs> what kind of mother lets their kids do that? We want to see how people should react and what advice you would have for them. Definitely discipline your kids. Nobody, no kid should act like that, especially in public. Throughout the day, Ava and Aiden run the entire naughty behavior playbook. <laughs> Playing tug of war. Give it. Hide and seek. Wherever you are, here I come. I found you. Ghost. I could go through walls. Even throwing things into occupied dressing rooms. Thank you. But no one reacts to our disruptive duo like Cindy Rafalowitz. I love this white dress so much. Do you like it? It's very pretty. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna draw on it. Happy markers. It needs a beautiful pattern. First, Cindy looks for help. Okay. And then she heads into a dressing room. 
while other shoppers react to Ava and Aiden redecorating that dress. I want to just, guys, leave me alone right now. I'm busy. This is my weekend, too. Is that theirs anymore? What? The top that they just put back? Oh, it's not mine. <laughs> They're drawing and putting yeah. food all over it. <laughs> oh, kids will be kids. <laughs> but that's the store's... Are you buying it? No. Back in that dressing room, Cindy overhears what's happening and can't hold back any longer. Are you serious right now? Well, I mean, it's Saturday. I, I'm not going to sit here and take care of them all you day. You are their mother. You are their mother. No one else here is supposed to take care of your children. You're riding on clothes at the moment. You're riding school. on clothes. But it's just kids being kids. You I don't... are riding on other people's property. Are you kidding me right now? What world do you live in? Well, I didn't give them permission to do this. Because you're not paying attention to them. What? That's why. They're dying for your attention five times. Well, no, I agree, but I, 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 I think me? No. One. I just think everyone should mind their own business. You really what? should mind Where's your own business. business. My, my own business. Where is the manager here? Yeah, because, because you know what? I just came by for crazy maniac because you're not paying attention because what's going on on your phone is more important. You're going to want the whole neighborhood to chip in and look for your kids, right? No, I know. But now you're telling us to mind our business. Be a mother. Be a parent. Or don't have children. Okay. I work too. I work too. Mother, don't let me off. Parents don't let me off. Are you kidding me right now? Do you have kids? My mother has six kids. She never had a day off in her life. Oh, wow. Ma'am? Wow. Oh, my God. I've Hi. never seen such a thing. Oh, my God. You felt compelled to say something. Just, just parents that you see like this all the time, and it's really disgusting, and no one ever says anything, and no. I'm just not the type of person to sit back.